You are welcome to the YouTube channel of the Society of Economics and Development. We will try to understand the kink demand curve in an oligopolistic market, firms cannot have a fixed demand curve since it keeps changing as competitors change the price's quantity of output. Since an oligopolist is not aware of the demand curve, economists have designed various price output models based on the behavior kink demand curve. In an oligopolistic market, firms cannot have a fixed demand curve since it keeps changing as competitors change the price's quantity of output. Since an oligopolist is not aware of the demand curve, economists have designed various price output models based on the behavior kink demand curve. In an oligopolistic market, firms cannot have a fixed demand curve since it keeps changing as competitors change the price's quantity of output. Since an oligopolist is not aware of the demand curve, economists have designed various price output models based on the behavior. Pattern of other firms in the industry. I in this article, we will look at the kink demand curve hypothesis. Kink demand curve in many oligopolist markets, it has been observed that prices tend to remain inflexible for a very long time. Even in the face of declining costs, they tend to change infrequently. American economist Sweezy came up with the kink demand curve hypothesis to explain the reason behind this price rigidity under oligopoly. According to the kink demand curve hypothesis, the demand curve facing an oligopolist has a kink at the level of the prevailing price. This kink exists because of two reasons, 1. The segment above the prevailing price level is highly elastic. 2. The segment below the prevailing price level is inelastic. The following figure shows a kink demand curve DD with a kink at point P. From the figure, we know that according to the kink demand curve hypothesis, the demand curve facing an oligopolist has a kink at the level of the prevailing price. This kink exists because of two reasons, 1. The segment above the prevailing price level is highly elastic. 2. The segment below the prevailing price level is inelastic. The following figure shows a kink demand curve DD with a kink at point P. From the figure, we know that the prevailing price level equals P the firm produces and sells output equals OM. Also, the upper segment, DP, of the demand curve, DD, is elastic. The lower segment, PD, of the demand curve, DD, is relatively inelastic. This difference in elasticities is due to an assumption of the kink demand curve hypothesis. That is all for today. I hope that you will like this information. To see more such videos, kindly like, share, and subscribe to the YouTube channel of the Society of Economics and Development, Ludhina. Thank you for watching.